होता है Answering. I'll just leave it. He's the one who ditched us. Where are we now then? I have no idea, but. Oh crap, they found us! Run! I don't know. I just thought to jump over there. Are you sure we're even allowed in here? I mean, who cares? We're probably not the first people to come in here anyway. Hmm. 
but we're gonna find a dead body here. Yeah, that's like a pretty good place to hide one. Whoa, look at them. Why the hell are there scarecrows here? I swear they're used to protect crops. I don't know, they're probably stolen or something. Never seen one up close before. What kind of name is Jape? I don't know, probably some older kids put those here. Why else would there be scarecrows in a place like this? Come on, let's look around some more. Watch this. Chance wasn't picking up. Oh, just stop trying then. You can probably leave now anyway. Don't be like that. Look at the size of this place. There's nothing here. We haven't even looked. We didn't even come in here to look. We only came in here to hide. What are you doing? Don't go over to it. It's just a scarecrow. I mean, it is Halloween, you know. Well, the, how the hell did they get there? Well, it's probably not the same one. Have you seen how many scarecrows there are around here? Come on, let's look around some more. This is weird, we should go. You're such a baby. Shut up, man. I'm getting sick of you bossing me around. Because you never do anything. Oh, whatever, I'm getting out of here. Eric, let's go!
Such an idiot. That's all your fault. I told you we should have left. How was I supposed to know what would happen? Still should have listened to me. You almost got us killed. Whatever. I don't need this. Yeah, well neither do I.
guys. Hey. Were you waiting for us? That's so nice. Welcome back, losers. So, do you guys all have plans for lunch? Uh, not really. We were just gonna have lunch over here by all our lockers. <laughs> <laughs> Did you want to join? Of course. If it's not too much trouble or anything. Oh, why would it be? Okay, great. I'll just run to my locker and grab my lunch and we'll be right back. Okay. How was school, sweetheart? Listen up, theater lovers. We'll be having a new student in class who was transferred from the boring world of biology to the exciting adventure that is drama class. Such a fun-filled world of drama. <laughs> She's late, so while we wait, today's topic of discussion is, if you could talk to someone in your life who has passed, what would you say to them? I'd say, I'd say it gets better. Hmm. Care to expand? Also, you are five minutes late. Not again in my class. I just meant maybe life after death really isn't that bad. There's no way she knew we were in this class. Is it okay if I sit here? <laughs> Thanks. How are we doing? There's... progress. Can't believe Mindy's even giving Belinda the time of day. Is she straight for Mindy? Piss off, Josh. <laughs> There's just something wrong with Belinda. Well, yeah, everything's wrong with Belinda. Should have never came home from winter break. It's okay, Dylan and My I'll... mother's coming. It's no bother. Also, we're having dinner at my house. I'd love for you to join. Um. I told my mother I have a new friend at school. Yeah, sure. Let me just text Dylan, okay? Seriously? Oh, damn. You wanna ride? Where's your partner in theatrical crime? Hmm? That is the last time I'm going to allow you to be late. This is the last day. I promise. Ah! <laughs> wow. 
Why would you take photography and drama? For the girls, obviously. She looks so serious. I've just never seen her not chirpy before. Maybe she's trying to impress her. By acting like a zombie? Maybe she brainwashed her. Formed a Belinda cult where the only rule is that you have to look like you're hiding something. <laughs> At all times. Remember to come in early on Monday if you still need to use the photo lab. Why do you keep on texting me? I just want to see what you're up to, man. I'm kind of busy right now. Oh. I'll call you back later. Well, All right. Call me. She looks so dead. That is what tends to happen. No, I, I, I mean like she'd been there for a while. Look at this photo. There is something seriously messed up going on. Uh, what? Someone kills themselves and then you just start saying that what? She, she's weird. Well, yeah, she was a freak, but still, man. She's dead, have some respect. It's called bleeding, dumbass. Photo doesn't develop properly, some of the ink bleeds together. Listen, I, I heard a sound coming from the closet. It led me to the body. Maybe you smelt it. I hear a body starts to smell not long after. No, I heard a sound. I don't know, man, maybe you have a sixth sense or something, but she was here today. It must have happened a few hours ago. Look, either way, I've never seen a dead body. What'd it look like? You have some respect. Gotta get out of here.
Hey. Um. I'm not sure if you heard about Belinda, but. Yes. I heard. Very unfortunate. We should have been nicer to her. Not being so quick to dismiss her. Yeah. Well, I thought you two were getting along. We were. I, I just meant before. You two. Early to my class. Oh, that's the first. I apologize for the prior tardiness, Miss Rodriguez. Never again. Oh, poor girl. She must be feeling awful right now. If you or Mindy ever need anything, I'm here for you. Can't believe we saw her right before she. Uh, a lot can change in a day. City needs a new coroner, though. Said you've been there at least a week. Despicable. just one of a ghost's many weaknesses. Watch out for holy water too. That stuff will uh... kill you. Take the damn pamphlets and let's do this orientation properly. I'm a ghost? That is awesome! Can I walk through walls? Can I fly? Not quite the response I was expecting, but okay. Welcome to the afterlife. Take a pamphlet. <laughs> we'll work on that. Come on. So, ground rules. Curfews at 8 a.m., curfew calls at 7 p.m. I think I found a better way to fuse a rock salt into the metal bullet. Double punch. Hadu hasn't responded since yesterday morning. Our anniversary is today. He's totally forgotten. I think you have more pressing issues than an AWOL boyfriend. You know, the cemetery's a mess. Your parents are gonna kill you. He's probably just busy with the shrine. <laughs> Good job, Joe. You're picking up solid optics usually takes a few days. Hey, it's okay. 
sure he's planning something big. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Nose. Hello. <laughs> I thought you might need some help. Mm, no worries. I'm almost done. <laughs> so, about tonight? Tonight? It's our anniversary. Oh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I was <laughs> thinking. Uh, what was that? Uh, Oh, you haven't heard of a yokai box? Yeah, me early. Yokai? Demons, right? Uh, evil ghosts in this case. No. Be careful, babe. I do kind of do this for a living. I know, it's just the ghosts in here are far more dangerous than your average Dante Cemetery cast. This isn't my first rodeo. Are we forgetting what happened with the Bradleys? I was just doing my job. And I saved your butt. It was one mistake. It won't happen again. Yeah, I'm sure. All right. Yeah, I forgot, but you can still have a good time, right? Be gone, evil spirits! So it's on this day, only see me in the spirits. They've been locked up for a thousand years. They'll do anything for power. They're gonna look for a body to possess. And then they're gonna suck up all the other ghosts. The cemetery. My parents are really gonna kill me. I told you not to touch the box. Those demons are not fucking up my cemetery. Evil ghosts. <gasps> Scott, meet us at the house. Let's suit up. My friends, no matter what, we stand together in the face of annoying dark forces released on a certain anniversary by a stupid boyfriend. Hey. Okay, I might have helped. The evil ghosts will probably attack the biggest crypt in the cemetery. I don't know how long the barrier will hold, but we are all going to have to be on guard. We'll hold them off. Good. Tonight, We fight, and tomorrow... I'm sorry. Is the end of the world boring you? Uh, no. What are you doing? I'm just practicing some new moves I learned the other day. Do you want to see? Is that why you didn't answer my text? Do we have to do this now? <sighs> the world doesn't end just because I forgot our anniversary. Uh, guys? This isn't finished. Where are they? I thought for sure they'd be here. Let me check the barrier. not Scotty anymore. Be gone, evil spirit. Your fight is not with this girl. Quite the contrary. I'm grateful she helped break the barrier. And now, 
There's another yokai box. It's the fastest way to draw them out of her. No, we have to expel the spirits from her body right now. Scotty doesn't have time. Did you guys always argue like this? All I'm asking is for you to respect my work and this relationship. I do. You're still learning. I've been doing this almost as long as you have. I get a little quiet, please. Oh, look, a little busy right now. I'm tired of trying to make you feel better about yourself. If you want to prove yourself, good luck. I'm going to get the box. Fine, I'll just fix everything on my own. Nothing new. Nova? Hey, I I'm having trouble changing the TV. There's just so many remotes. Enough! The fresh spirits of the fire. Please don't. left me when I needed you the most. I think it's best we break up. Take care of yourself. Oh, 
Hello. Noah, you didn't come back home tonight. Cannot wait to see you. Hollywood. Oh yeah, no, this place was built in 1929. Yeah? Oh, uh, you got the instructions for the uh, the TV and the Wi-Fi, right? Uh, also, the uh, AC unit is over here. Yeah, so what about the uh, kitchen? You want to take a look? Sounds good. All right. Uh, if you want to do some ironing, you get to use the um, Murphy ironing board, I like to call it. Yeah, uh -huh. just throw your clothes down there, yeah. Put it back away, no problem. We'll watch your head on this thing. Well, you don't need to, but okay. Uh, if you're gonna iron, take the iron here. Don't burn yourself though with the. So, what brings you to LA? I'm an actor. I live in New York. I'm just out here for auditions and meetings with agents. You know that whole song and dance. Cool. Very cool. Congratulations. Thank you. I'm sure you get a lot of Hollywood hopefuls out here doing Airbnb. Yeah. Oh, actually, yeah. And you've come to the right place. So. Come here, let me show you this. Okay, you see this, uh, the, well, the window with the bars on it down there, it's uh, part of this unit, right? That runs all the way down to the, uh, well, to the street. And it's a two bedroom, but, uh, well, guess who used to live there? I don't know. David Schwimmer, the friends guy. Seriously? He lived there for years, <laughs> yeah. Is this place not lucky or what? Yeah, I hope so. <laughs> I'll show you the bedroom. And for towels, uh, they're in the linen closet, plenty of them. Um, but if you do need more, we do have some here in the bathroom. So that's about it. Well, thank you. This place is beyond charming. Even this little shelf thing. Do you know what it's for? Yeah, I do. Actually, it's funny that you're asking. It's a phone niche for where you put uh, the, you know, the phone back in the old landline days, you know. Oh, speaking of actors. Um, Actually, I don't want to waste your time with some weird story. But. No, you can. I'm happy to hear. Okay. Uh, well, my, my grandfather, uh, he used to tell me this one story about this particular woman who lived in this unit. And, uh, well, believe it or not, she was the very first movie star. Okay, now you're messing with me. No, no, I'm not. A hand to the man, I swear. Like, she was there at the... Wait, her name. What was her name? Uh, first and last name rhyme, but, uh, yeah. That's incredible. Wait, so the phone? Oh, yeah, well, okay. Um, she had had a, a bunch of setbacks in the in the 20s and uh, lost most of her fortune, but it crashed at 29. So by the 30s, she was living here and she'd always hoped to make a big comeback, you know? And my grandpa said that she kept a chair that sat right here. And she sat in that chair all day, every day for weeks, months, to years, just hoping that the studios would call and give her some big role again, you know? But, uh, no, I mean, she just waited and, and waited and nothing, um, you know? But, uh, I don't know why I'm telling you this. Uh, anyway, I'll leave you to it. So, uh, if you need anything, just uh, text me. Um, and uh, enjoy your stay. Thank you. Okay, great.
Lawrence, Lawrence. Florence Annie Bridgewood, known on stage and screen as Florence Lawrence, is considered the first movie star of all time. She was the first actress to rocket to stardom through that latest technological marvel, the moving picture. The earliest film actors were total unknowns who didn't even get screen credits for their performances. But in 1906, that would change forever when Florence Lawrence first appeared in Vitagraph Pictures, The Automobile Thieves, and mobs of moviegoers demanded to know the name of that electrifying young woman. After a meteoric rise to superstardom, her career would begin to decline when she was badly injured in a studio fire on the set of the 1915 film Pawns of Destiny. As her health problems mounted across the 1920s and 30s, her star would fade into almost total obscurity. Founder of Universal Pictures started a rumor that Lawrence had been killed. Film appearances would slow across the next 15 years. By the 1930s, Lawrence's career had dwindled to bit parts and extra work. Often uncredited. On the afternoon of December 28, 1938, Lawrence ingested a lethal mixture of cough syrup and a household ant poison called ant paste.
the fuck is out there? This is uh, MGM Studios calling. Um, we um, we have an, an audition uh, in a uh, Mr. DeMille's latest picture. Um, please report to the front office. Please, sorry, please.
Ah, what a glorious creep show that I put together. <laughs> well, well, that's all for this year. This has been a glorious Halloween. My last Halloween at my current location. And it was good to celebrate it. Somebody